Welcome to day three of your trampoline beginner challenge. My name is Michelle. We are still building on those foundation movements, still keeping them grounded. We're gonna add a little bit of intensity today. We're gonna throw in some core at the end of this workout. Remember, focus on your posture. Keep that core tight. Tempo two, if you feel like it's too fast, go to a pace that works for you. Remember, you can always hit pause if you need a break, get some water, and then come back. And if there's any confusion, always go back to your basic bounce. Go ahead and get yourself on that trampoline, get in set position, keep that core braced, keep the shoulders relaxed, and let's have some fun. So we're gonna to start to squat, down and up. Remember, throughout the workout, you wanna keep your core braced, and the movements smaller can be easier, and then they can get bigger for you. Little pushes. Now, if the arms get confusing, just focus on the legs and your core. And I keep that little bend. My butt is almost pushing back a little bit here. Step touch, bring it in. And sometimes it's good to come back to the fundamentals and really nail the moves. You can always get more out of the time as so you come back and do the workouts. Wide for four, push it down. Narrow, out four. Narrow. Jacks. Four more, then we're pushing those heels out to the corners, right then left. Rainbow. Now keep the length in your spine, pull up and in. Nothing to look down at right now, you should know your surface. Four more, back to your basic. Relax your shoulders, yeah. Step touch. Maybe more arms. Open up that chest. Wide for four. Narrow. As you get warmer, you can start to pop those knees up. Keep the core really braced. Jacks. Four more, then it's right heel, left heel. Rainbows. Give me that basic. All right, we're going to be throwing in some double front to backs. So you're going to see a new move, ski, where we go side to side with that narrow stance. Start with your jacks. Take it out. Now, what I said, don't worry about the arms, right? If they want to go all the way up, go for it. Four more. Double front, double back. Push forward. Pull yourself back. You use a little momentum. How about those jumping jacks? Open out. We're going to combine those two moves. Front to back doubles. Try it again. Four jacks. Double front, double back. Two of these. You got it now? Jack four. Front back. We're getting ready to surf. Right hip to you. For four. Left surf. Right. We're going to throw you right into space. 
Left hip. Jack for four. Take it up. Four. Front back twos. Jack. You should be having fun right now, right? Front to back two. All right, you guys, get ready to surf again. Right hip, throw it down. Four. Left hip. Let's do that again before we add that ski. I'm gonna show you that ski. All right, we're gonna go hop side to side with that narrow bounce. Ready, go. Oh. So maybe you just go like this. Whoa. We got the narrow. Woo. Option changing the arms. Oh yeah, don't hit the brakes. <laughs> Jack out for four. Double front, double back. Do it again, Jack four. Double front, double back. Surf right hip. Four. Left hip. Right hip. I'm getting into this. How about you? Left hip. All right, let's change it a little bit. First start to ski. Come on. Yeah. Feel that energy? Yeah. Woo. Jack out for four. Double front, double back. Jacks. Front back. Surf right. Left. I'm gonna ski right now. Oh yeah, you just got intense right there. Woo, nice job, that was fun, wasn't it? So we're gonna throw in another move today. This is my run. I keep the toes down, give me basic. So remember that run, you might see some people lifting their feet off that mat. And if you are ready for it, you can do that. But I'm gonna stay with my toes staying in contact with that mat. I'm gonna run, right heel, left heel. Oh, and she said running. Cheek to cheek is my hands. Face cheek, butt cheek. Right there, right? Jazz hands. Step touch right here. I'm gonna crisscross my arms because we're gonna change this into a jack cross in a moment. But if you don't feel comfortable, you stay here. Jack cross, out, then in, out, cross. So we're gonna go from that wide to narrow, but super narrow. We use the inner thighs, we squeeze. Or, I stay here. Out for three, wide. One, two, three, narrow. In, one, two, three, in. Watch my hands. Out, pull in. You got this? Be dramatic. How about a couple more? You got it now, right? We're gonna run. Heels up. All right, I'm really lifting my t heels up and pointing that toe. Core tight. You can step touch or jack cross. Go out then in, out cross, or here. Woo! We got that wide three in one. Are you ready to add on to this? Give me one of these. Surf right two. Wide three. Surf left two. Try it again. Out here. 
Three, two, one, sir. Three, two, one, and sir for two. So we got a three, one, two. Did I really confuse you? All right? Good. Run. You can even do a little jump rope, right? Or cheek to cheek. Plenty of options here. Jack cross out in. Or step touch. I'm still working hard right here. Woo, come on. Now, we're gonna move right into that wide three in one with the two surfs. Can you try it with me? One, two, three, in, turn, turn. Last time, relax. Woo, nice job. So let's just bring it down for a moment. We're gonna try some core work today. We're gonna come on your back, look at the sky for a sit up. <sighs> Woo, good job. <sighs> Take a deep breath here. Feet are grounded. Hands are behind the head. Another great tool is your towel, right? You can place it behind your head if your neck is tense and tight. Or maybe you have a lot of stress in your life, right? This is a great way to relieve stress. Crunch it up. Taking time out of your day to take care of you is so important. And the trampoline is such an amazing tool. It activates every single cell in your body like nothing else. As you crunch, look towards your thighs. Push your back into the mat. Or maybe tuck your tailbone a little bit. Up to then reach. Up, reach and sweep. So you try to get a little effort. One, two, reach, come down. Keep this. Nice job. Using a little momentum in the reach and sweep. Two more. You stay nice and lifted here. All right, let's anchor the hands back. Hold the knees into the chest. And then push your low back. So sometimes you need to hug the knees for a moment. Hold them there. We're gonna be doing a small hip lift, keeping the heels dropped towards your butt. I'm just gonna roll it in and then roll it down. You go at your own tempo. And how low you go with the feet just depends on your body. But I'm keeping the heels tight to my butt and bringing those knees in towards the chest and shoulders. So it's a combination of like a hip lift, reverse crunch, And again, you are anchoring behind you. That's gonna help you lift those hips from the mat. You're gonna do two more. And then keep the knees into the chest. Give them a little hug. Lift up the head and shoulders. And then from their hands behind the head, a little bicycle, rotate to the front, to the back. Whew. Nice rotation. And again, you can go at your pace. You don't need to go to the tempo of the music. We just have a few more of these. Give me four, three, two, one. Oh, ooh, nice job. And then I want us to do a plank. We're gonna do a forearm plank using the trampoline. This is such a great tool that you have here at home. So forearms are gonna be on, feet come back. And this is your first forearm plank with us. Elbows under the shoulders. Now make sure the hips are around shoulder height so you can kind of tuck your tailbone a little bit. Feel like someone's gonna punch you in the stomach and you pull up and in. Do you got that feeling? Now relax your shoulders a little bit. Feel like you're dragging yourself forward over the trampoline surface. And every time that you exhale, pull up and in a little bit more. And if you have a soft surface underneath you, if you need to, you can always drop one knee. Build up that strength. This is the transverse abdominal. This is the, the muscle that holds your guts in. It gives you length.
Relax, straddle stretch. Come to the hands, open the feet wide. Hands stay on your surface, drop your head between your arms. You did super for day three. Oh, be grateful to this body. And then step one foot back, use that surface to help you in a lunge. Pushing the heel back, opening up through that hip flexor. And then pull it in, let's go toes up on the other leg. Drop the chest. So when we have mobility and flexibility, that's gonna help you even more in your workouts. All right, let's switch the legs. Lunge it back. Push your heel back. Take a few nice deep breaths here. That's gonna help you recover. Your breathing is so important. And even throughout your day, make sure you take deep breaths. Okay? Sometimes we just, we're under so much stress. So get on the trampoline for a moment. Jump a little bit, relieve that stress. Toes up. Don't let it be a surface to dry your clothes on, right? All right, you guys, release, relax. Shoulders roll. Let's do a nice big inhale, having the gratitude for your body. Pull it into your heart. Touch that heart of yours. Look at what it all is doing for you. Take a nice deep breath. Let it out. You have an awesome day. Let me thank my crew. Thank you, Diane. Thank you, Anna. We got Jude back in the corner. Welcome to the driveway. We got Catherine back here and Carol and high 10 to you. Thank you guys. And we'll see you back on that trampoline. Take care.